Navigating to the system pane, notice the two programs associated with the header smart object under CIP system 2. Because they are both part of a smart object instance, they can be allocated simultaneously to a controller. Furthermore, since the header smart object is part of the hierarchical structure of CIP system 2 down to equipment and down to the smart object itself, the programs under it inherit that structure as well. This again, helps with visibility and tracking of programs associated hierarchy in the execution pane. So let's start by allocating both programs. With the header smart object selected, we'll navigate to the properties pane on the far right. Under allocation, we'll select CIP system 2 CMX for the controller and CIP control for the task. Navigating back to the execution pane, notice the programs associated with the header smart object were both allocated at the same time under the specified controller and task. A key advantage is the ability to structure the code logically, all the while retaining the program structure when allocating it to a controller. This allows users familiar with Studio 5000 Logics Designer to organize and view their code in a more task-based approach while still taking advantage of Factory Talk Design Studio's modern programming practices.